Hello, this is Ants. There is a significant performance issue in Godot 4.3 and 4.4. It was introduced in 4.3 and it's still with us in 4.4 um, that significantly reduces um, your FPS in your games, regardless if it's 2D or 3D. And I'm gonna show you what is the cause? And at the end of the video, I'm gonna show you um, how to fix it and also um, the silver lining uh, about it. So uh, so there's good news at the end of the video. So anyways, um, let's write down uh, the FPS and it's less than 240, right? And I'm gonna increase the performance uh, by just changing a few things um, right now. So the issue uh, with 4.3 and 4.4 is, believe it or not, it's just the label. It's it's not uh, all, all over the place, but it's just the label. And the label doesn't, uh, it, br it breaks batching of rendering whenever you use outline or shadows. So now I got rid of outlines and shadows here. And let's and oh, let's uh, look at the debugger and the draw calls are about a, a thousand fifty. So let's see the performance now. So we had two hundred forty before, and uh, what do we have now? We have over four hundred. Uh, let's just say four hundred. Right, and um, before it was 240. So it's it's significant. It's um, more than 50%. It's less than 100%, but it's in between 50 and 100%, that's 75%. So that's huge. Now the only drawback is, is now my um, text doesn't have um, dropped uh, shadows and outline, right? So uh, prove it to you that that was the issue and it's a huge uh, impact and the draw calls is down to 450. Now, so what's going on uh, with Godot? What's the silver lining? Well, the silver lining is, uh, you know, this was detected three months ago and uh, there was even a project that basically draws a bunch of labels and that's it. And it, it was detected that there is uh, an issue at least with the shadows, but it's actually worse. It's even the outline. And uh, so, um, they put in uh, an issue, but it's been fixed already. So it's been fixed and it's been merged uh, into 4.5 uh, release. So what the silver lining here is, this is fixed in 4.5. It was actually fixed in 4.5 dev 1. I think we're in 4.5 dev 3. And so we still have to go through the development cycle and then the, um, the beta cycle. So we're still a couple of months off. So um one good thing is this problem is going to go away in the future and you could use outlines and all that and it's basically they're basically saying it's twice as faster now it's going to be twice as fast uh and john clay reviewed it already so everything is good to go okay so that's good news but until then what what can you do if you're still on 3.4.3 uh, and 4.4 so some of the people what they're doing is they're basically drawing the label twice, one for um, the yellow and then one for the drop shadow. Now, they basically said that is less of an impact than actually the way the stock 4.3 and 4.4 is rendering because it's basically breaking batching and you don't get any efficiency. So that's another way of fixing it. But uh, yeah. Um, I'm glad I actually uh, found it and if you're uh, a viewer of my videos and you already knew this, I wish I knew, you, you, you told me uh, prior to the game jam. Uh, I'm really glad of this happening because I've, I've really, really optimized. I, did, I thought it was not using texture atlases. Everything you see on the screen now, all these uh, icons 64 by 64, texture atlases, my grid map, um, um, uses a mesh library that has this half the number of meshes and also all those meshes use the same material. Uh, 
uh, every uh, single uh, mesh had its own material. I actually consolidated all of them use one single material. What I'm getting at is I optimized this game so much that the size of the game now is from 200 megs to like 90 megs. And um, you know, these FPS numbers also include a lot of the um, uh, performance enhancements I did. Uh, but um, yeah, so things are much more are, are quick and I have a lot of FPS room to do more uh, fancy effects. So I'm really, really happy about that. Anyways, summarize 4.3 and 4.4, the label, major performance impacts. And as you can see, I have a lot of labels, but it's not really that many. I mean, there's probably about 60 labels uh, on the screen here. Even with 60 labels, I'm getting uh, sig significant performance impacts. So if you're if you want to increase your performance and you're actually using outlines and shadows on your labels, then uh, if you want to improve performance until 4.5 uh, comes out, you know what to do now. Okay. Hopefully you enjoyed this video and take care.